Okay, this is how to name alkyl halides. So, actually I'm going to go in here, get our periodic table out. Okay, let's copy this. Drag it into here. Okay, the periodic table isn't working. Anyways, alkyl halides, you'll see is, well, they're the halogens. They're one away from the noble glass. It consists of... Why won't it let me draw? So the halogens consist of fluorine. Underneath fluorine is chlorine. Underneath that is bromine. Underneath that is iodine. And underneath that is... A T, whatever that is. I don't know. You'll never see it. You don't need to worry about it. Alright. So, just as easy as it sounds, let's draw a halogen. Alright. So, just like a normal carbon chain, except before, where this would have two hydrogens off of it, you never draw the hydrogens, because it takes a long time to draw all of them. Um, if you have a halide in there, it's just going to basically remove one of these hydrogens. Uh, let's get rid of you. And it's going to put a halogen. Any one, it doesn't matter. So, let's put a chlorine in here. Okay, so numbering this is really easy. Just one, two, three, four, five. You'd call this a two chloro pentane. Okay, that's not that bad. And in fact, that's about as hard as it gets. It's really not too bad at all. Okay, so let's take out a pentane with a lot. So let's take chlorine here, let's take a fluorine here, and a iodine over here. Gonna have another iodine. Oh man, this thing will give you cancer in about two seconds. Okay. So... Okay, so this looks pretty cool. So let's, first let's draw in the longest chain, because you can't can really even see it. So our longest chain is going to run from here, over here, and up through here. Okay, numbering it, we're going to number from this side, because there's more alkyl halides over here, or more halides over here than there are over here. So, this is going to be a 1 carbon. Oh, you can't even see that. 1, you can't even see that. I have no idea what color I can make this. How about yellow? You can kind of see that. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So we have 5 carbons in there. Okay. And so we have quite a bit of alkyl halides. So let's start with naming just pentane. That's our main group. All right. So now let's find we have some iodos. All right. So our iodines come on here, one on the first and one on the second. So we have one, two. And then we have diiodo, because there's two of them. Um, let's go chloro. So we have a 1-chloro and a 3-chloro. So we have 1-3-dichloro. Um, naming bromines, we have... We only have one bromine, it's on two, so we have 2-bromo. And then we have 
135 try Oh, man, that's not how you spell it. F-L-U-O-R-O -O, pentane. Okay, so that's how you name... I'm pretty sure that's how you name fluoro. Let's Google it. F-L-U-O-R-O. -O. Yep, it is. Okay, so this is how you would name this one. And that's basically it for alkyl halides. They don't get a whole lot harder than that. Next, we're going to be doing probably carboxylic acids.